We're watching it uh, very anxiously to see what happens. We've got webcams that we're watching. John McKay and his family from Wolfville, Nova Scotia, anxiously monitor their Florida home as Hurricane Milton approaches. I think this is the fourth hurricane we've had since we've had our home down there for 13 or 14 years. Fourth time we've installed the hurricane shutters, but this one is looking like it's going to be a direct hit. Well, in Canada, all the McKays can do is hope their preparation was enough. When we built the home, it was built to the hurricane standards. At this point, we're just waiting with beta breath to hope that it uh, goes south or turns direction, not to wish bad luck to anyone else, but inland enough where the flood, the surge won't be a problem, but it's going to be the wind. You know, these are record winds that we're going to receive, and I fully expect that we'll probably have some roof damage or pool cage will have some screens blowing out or something like that, but those are all fixable. In true Canadian spirit, John selflessly hopes for the best for Florida residents. The only thing that we're fortunate that it's not our year-round home, so if it is damaged, you know, we can wait while other people get their year-round homes fixed up. We've got a flight book for Monday if planes are working and running. The nice thing about Florida we've found in the past that getting work on the house has been very easy, but that's not when 10,000 other people want in their roof repaired, so I expect we're going to have to wait or see what happens. But. You know, we, we're optimistic that the damage will be minimal, so we hopefully we can maybe deal with it ourselves when we get down.